Welcome back to my channel and today we are going to take a look at some of the recent Heroclix purchases that I made all the way from US. It took quite a while for it to reach from US to Singapore and I'm really excited to be opening my Heroclix that I purchased. And I do purchase singles quite frequently so why not record them and share it to you guys. And let's take a look at our first figure over here that I purchased and this is the Exo Sword Chase Blink. Bling is one of the chases that I've been trying to secure since the launch of the set. She was actually one of the chases that I wanted to open during my brick unboxing as well as the suit tournament events. So I'm actually happy to secure her quite affordable during one of the eBay bids that I went for. And let's take a look at the character card because I recall she has one very interesting trait which is the Bling portals which you can create them at the beginning of the turn. And let's take a look at the card over here. She also has the Improved Movement, Destroy Blocking, and Characters. As you can see, the Blink Bottle trait. And she's only at 75 points. She has Hypersonic and Flight. She also has this interesting defense power. Super Senses, when she's missed by an attack after resolutions, you may deal 1 penetrating damage to an opposing character within 3 squares of a portal marker. What an interesting figure to use and I can't wait to build her in my X-Men team or maybe even my SWAT team teams that I've been trying to build with the Prime Vision that was released in Disney Plus. So I'm still looking into that team and I do hope that I can fit Bling and Prime Vision together. As we can see, I got a couple more figures. Here we have his John Stewart. This is the super rare figure that came from Batman team up. I think he's a very interesting sculpt where he's screaming in pain and agony and this figure actually belongs to uh, one of my friends who made a purchase. And we got John Stewart, he has a willpower trait which is also quite interesting. Willpower traded however he has last three clicks of willpower as well. I'm not sure why they gave him willpower twice. He also has the infamous Green Lantern team ability where you can carry eight characters in total. So very nice super rare figure. And let's take on a look at the next figure which is the Uncommon Broomerang which is also not a purchase of mine. Pretty interesting figure. I do recall that there is a special object Broomerang that came in the Spider-Man Beyond Amazing set. So you can use this equipment with Broomerang over here at zero points. And let's take a look at our next item. Okay, let's put that aside. Okay, we got a couple of police officers, also not mine. These figures can be generated by the Rare Kingpin from the Spider-Man Beyond Amazing set. A really affordable figure coming in at only 15 points with the police team ability. This is a great generic figure that you can get from the set. And speaking of generics, Spider-Man Beyond Amazing also had a couple of hand ninjas which is the uncommon black suit hand ninja and the red suit hand ninjas as well. And let's take a look at the scalp first. They are the same identical scalp, just a different paint job. I really like how they did this and this is a common uncommon figure. He's well equipped. He got a katana at the back of his uh, back. And let's take a look at the common one. 20 points, stealth and can make 2 markers of smoke cloud for free. Also has the Masters of Evil team ability. And the uncommon is also at 20 points. Blades, claws, fangs, giant reach 2 as well as amp power makes this fig really worth. And I find it weird that the black suit ninja has blades, claws, fangs and the red suit ninja has stealth. I think it should have been the other way around. But let us just take a look at the next figure that we have which is the rare symbiote which is the symbiote cosmic and monster keyword. I find this figure really cool because if we were to get KO'd you can still bring in the symbiote object from your sideline and equip it to another character. I think that's really cool and so many clicks and so many powers all for 30 points. Special movement power of charge, leap climb, plasticity and stealth. Special defense power of super senses, toughness and some vulnerability to energy explosion and quake. This is a very powerful 30 points figure and it also has a very strong prime version as well which is a prime venom symbiote spider-man. Both are awesome figures and highly recommended. And let's take a look at the equipments that I purchased for myself which is the web shooters. 
which comes in at 5 points or free if you have the qualifying keyword of Spider-Man family. It has the incapacitate, and when this character uses it, until your next turn, hit characters can't remove action tokens except for by clearing. And here's our next object, which is the Billy Clubs, Leap Climb, and this character gains an extra targeting. It is a qualifying name of Daredevil. If not, you can pay 5 points just for this Billy Clubs. I think this is a very good equipment, especially for those characters with mind control, such as the 95 points Exodus from X-Men Rise and Fall. And here's our last object, which is the Pumpkin Bombs, qualifying name Green Goblin, Hop Goblin. An energy explosion, if the character can already use energy explosion, they do 3 damage instead of the normal 2 damage. Amazing for 5 points as well. I think this is a very good utility use for characters such as the Shogo Jubilee, yeah? Or maybe even the Black Heart, where he already has the top down of the 75 points where he has energy explosion you can always destroy one of your hellfire club cards to make it penetrating penetrating tree damage energy explosion can be really painful against an opposing team and now moving on to the last item for this video which is the chase scrappy scrappy do and i'm so excited to get this figure because i find myself playing quite a number of celebrity keyword characters such as sakarian iron man so fun thing about Scrappy-Doo, he can actually generate himself if a character with a shared keyword such as Celebrity were to be KO'd and you can actually generate this Scrappy-Doo on Click Tree, which has Close Combat Expert and Outwit. He also has a charge and super strength so immediately when he were to be generated, he can start attacking your opposing characters and with the change to super strength, I think this figure can be used for instances such as moving blocking terrain or maybe any of the new terrain markers that you can find in this game and like what scrappy do says puppy power and if you enjoyed this video do give a like share and subscribe and i can't wait to see you in the next one